Namaste, my name is Kaylin. This is Sora. Uh, welcome to our last day in Puerto Rico, our last vlog in Puerto Rico. Right now, we just got some coffee. Here's our coffee. Uh, we went to Cuatro Sombras. We went to Cuatro Sombras. Yeah, this is pretty nice. This is our third time here, so make sure you check it out. This is a cute little coffee shop. We right where we parked, so we parked, came here, mm -hmm. got some coffee, and now we're just gonna enjoy our last morning here in Old Town San Juan. Um, it's already getting hot. I think it's around. It's about seven. 80 degrees. 80 degrees. Yeah, eighty degrees. It's about seven thirty, eight o'clock right now, and the sun's already up. But we're gonna explore the streets one more time, and then we have to check out of our Airbnb at eleven. So. Our stuff is still at our Airbnb, so we're gonna explore here. We're gonna go pack our stuff and take everything out and explore the rest of San Juan. So, sir, so we're putting on sunscreen right now. Uh, two recommendations we would give you when you come to San Juan. If you want good pictures, come early in the morning before it gets super hot and before the lighting changes, because in the morning there's better lighting for pictures. and. Second recommendation, put on sunscreen so you don't get burnt. I got super burnt. Even Saurabh got burnt. And brown. And he's brown, so wear sunscreen. Yeah, if you go out to the beach, make sure to put sunscreen. Not the regular amount, because that's what we do. But like extra, extra amount, like every hour, like heavily, so. So we, we usually sure wear SPF 50 or 65, but I highly recommend getting SPF 100. 120. Yeah. yeah, it's pretty sunny, so it's hard to avoid. And that's it. We are gonna go up those streets, explore some more, go by the castle, and head back to our Airbnb. Today is our final day here. I'm so sad. Today is our final day here, and we are not excited to go back, but we are hoping for the next trip pretty soon. So that will keep us moving and. That's what we'll look forward to. Today we have flight at midnight, so we have all day. So that's that's really good that we have the whole day. So um, Saurabh and I, we just checked out of our Airbnb. We changed too, just because it was super hot in the morning. So right now we're about 10 minutes from San Juan, about eight minutes from our Airbnb, and we're getting acai bowls, or at least maybe I am, but this is the area. Cute little town. They have all kinds of shops on the side of the street. They have the cookie store right here. So I'm going to this one. It's called Acai Express. And yay, they're open. Oh, thank you. A lot of options for acai bowls. We have acai, California bowls, skinny bowls, coconut, mango, so much to choose from. I got the Malibu bowl, it has strawberries, acai base, banana, granola, and some fruit. Looks good. Strawberry, banana, granola, acai. Tastes good. Right now, Saurabh and I, we came to the San Juan Mall and they have a dealership right inside the mall. They have bikes, cars, ATVs, ATVs little ATVs. These are for kids, these are for adults. Look at all these bikes. Nice, looks nice. Yeah, $10,000 for that. 11000 I think that's a lot of money for a bike. Our car is cheaper than that. Yeah, especially if you can buy a new car for $20,000 and it's a car. <laughs> what people have yeah. there. I mean, I wouldn't buy a bike because I would buy like a moped or a, what, is, what are the one Vespa, I'd buy a yeah, Vespa, Vespa but nice. not a motorcycle. I'm sure that's expensive as well, but yeah, mall, mall looks nice. Pickleball at the mall. <laughs> I Puerto Ricans are obsessed with pickleball as well. 
It was raining outside, um, so now it's just the perfect time for us to be in the mall. So we're at the top of the mall and we found this cute little mercado, little, uh, we found this cute little place that has a bunch of restaurants and Sarab and I ended up, he ended up getting a margarita and I got pesto pasta. This is a super cute place. We have so many different kinds of food options. Olive oil, parmesan, and red chili flakes, and more parmesan. This looks so good. So this is all fresh. And it, everything smells so good. If you end up coming to the San Juan Mall, I recommend going up to the top level to El Nuevo Mercado and getting the margarita pizza. 10 out of 10 would recommend and I probably would come back again and get it. I also got this little drink. This has um, orange liquor, prosecco, gin, and it has a cute little garnish. How is it, Sora? 10 out of 10. Sora says 10 out of 10, that music was super good. My god. So there's a place in Old San Juan called Anita's Gelato. They say if you come here, you need to go try that. So maybe later, once we go to Old Town, I'll try that there. But super nice. It's raining. It's always sunny and raining. Yeah. You can never tell when it's going to rain because it's always sunny and then it starts raining. But. We're gonna head out from the mall, go check out a beach area, and enjoy our last, what, six hours in Puerto Rico. about 5 p.m. and we made it to Old Town again. Again. <laughs> we need to pay for parking and look at this view. It's gorgeous. It's like the hillside of... You can see the other side. Look at all the trees. All mountains over there. That's yeah, the mountains. east side, I think. It's all the city over there. Yeah, city view and ocean view. This looks so pretty. So we are up the hill now and this is a cute hole in the wall, literal hole in the wall shop and this is where they sell some frozen popsicles in a cup and you have to ring a bell and they will come to you. We saw somebody grab a popsicle from here and we were like let's go check it out. That's where the flavors are. Um, I think she got strawberry and then it's one dollar each I think if you have cash just bring cash she got strawberry and orange so so this is the furthest point you can walk to right here the other fort they have on the edge of the town and nice area nice breeze out here the rainbow there's a rainbow uh -huh. where kidar kidar oh yeah there is a rainbow i cannot see right over there 
feels a little tiring walking up the hill in this heat but we didn't go inside so at least come and check it out so right now Saurab and I are at the I cannot say it in Spanish so I'm just going to say Princess Fountain mm -hmm. uh, it's sunset time right now you can see the sun is starting to set look at the beautiful fountain and it's pretty busy here on a Sunday night they had booths all the way up there full of crafts so that was really cool to see you can see all the people here taking pictures and the temperature has gotten calmer it's not as hot this is the fountain they have at the end it's super pretty with the water view. This is a great place to watch the sunset. So we're going to enjoy the sunset here and maybe grab something to eat in Old Town. I got this to go mojito. So this is wild berry. So it has strawberries, I think that, a little daru, uh, club soda, mint, so mojito. I'm gonna enjoy the last night. Mm -hmm. so sad. Definitely recommend coming to Puerto Rico if you get the chance. And you don't really need to rent a car. Sorab's in his element taking photos. He loves taking photos <laughs> of people. Look at this sun's sun's already setting. So pretty. Look at those clouds right there. And you can see uh, looks like a rainbow, but might be just the way the sun's hitting. But it's super pretty. Uh-huh, taking some photos. Always. In his element. Look at the view. I know, I just, I just said, I thought that was rainbow, but I think it's just the sun. 